Okay, this is Ray J2 here, and this is time for another Let's Play. And today, we're going to start up the highly anticipated Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. That's right, we're finally starting the THPS 4 LP, so let's get it on. This is the Activision O2 Sports Revolution logo. A lot of revolutions going on back then, especially in the world of sports. And here is a gorilla. I think people thought people back then thought, oh look, Gorilla, secret character in the game. Nope. Wasn't meant to be. At least I don't think he's secret. I'm pretty sure he's not. There's a Neversoft eyeball getting stabbed. Can't have a Tony Hawk game without that now, can we? And here's some ACDC for you. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4, and we're not watching that because it's Kind of long and dried out. I'm sure if you can, I'm sure you can find that clip somewhere else online. Anyway, this is Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. Unlike the first three games in the series, the two-minute runs have been replaced with basically just a lot more goals. So let's start up a new career mode. This is Larry. He's gotten a makeover since Tony Hawk 3. So he doesn't look as ugly. I've already built up his stats just a little bit, but we haven't played anything with him yet. So let's start up a new game. There are um, a few levels here. College, 16 goals to do. So let's just get started here. We have a lot of things to do. This is the longest Tony Hawk game. Hey, if you um, want to open up some time. Escape, try talking to some of the guys with the arrows over their heads. Press A to continue. Okay, who was that? Whoever was talking to me isn't there anymore. So anyway, instead of two-minute runs of the previous three Tony Hawk games, now you have to walk up to or skate up to these citizens. And they'll give you goals instead. Let's see what he has to say. Tom is running for chief of security? You've got to be kidding Wall right up the walls, then wally up and grind the banners down. Okay, so basically, um, Officer Tom is hated for some reason, so let's take down his banners. This is Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. All the goals are timed. However, they are timed at once you start the goal, which is a lot, um, that is a, what am I trying to say here? That is a better way of doing it. That was a very easy goal. I set a new record. This game keeps records of all of your goals. And this is the professor. Um, yeah, let's talk to him. Let's see if you can even spell. Try to collect the skate letters. I'm not sure if Larry can spell, but I can. Anyway, here it's time to collect the letters in skate. And unlike the first three Tony Hawk's Pro Skater games where I had all the goals memorized here, well, I basically don't. So. We're going to be playing through this together. I don't know where the skate letters are. If I find them, I'll collect them. But this isn't my top choice for goals right now. But we're going to be doing it anyway, and why can't I get up there? Let's see, let's see. You're supposed to jump off this thing? Okay, let's try that again. Up you go, thank you. There's the letter K, and there's some more cash. Cash will get... There's the professor again. Cash buys things in the shop. You can buy lots of things. You can buy new tricks. I'm not sure if you buy stats with it, but you can definitely buy secret items and things like that. Lots of nice secret things. So much to talk about in this first episode. The new spine transfer... That is a spine transfer. This That was introduced in Tony Hawk 4. You weren't able to do a spine transfer in any of the previous games, and people seem to forget about that for some reason. Ah, uh, where's the letter E? I thought I saw it here somewhere. Let's do another spine transfer and find it. I know you're down here. There you are, okay. Thank you, Professor. Yes, I can spell basic five-letter words, and yes, you get stat points for specific goals. I don't know what to... let's boost up speed, because it's nice and easy. I still don't want to save yet. 
because I want to do more goals. That's basically all this game is. There's not much of a storyline. It's just goals, and this guy just got trash canned. Let's talk to him. Yeah, the voice acting in this game isn't the best, but it's funny, I guess. So anyway, now we have to um, get back at the frat boys by injuring them, I guess. There's three out of five. It's time, I think there's some up there. Let's find out. Um, yeah, there's one up there. I think there's there might be the other two as well. Get up there, get up there, get up there. Thank you. Crash up there. There's one and the last one. The horror. The horror. I don't know what was so horrible about that. I don't know why he's shaking his fist. I'm gonna boost all these stats off screen. Cause you don't really need to see me do that. Lots of lots of random cash icons just floating around. Let's talk to the skate rat. Hey dude, Officer Tom's after our buddies again. Officer Tom? You gotta warn him before he gets there. Officer Tom, not Officer Dick. Okay, whatever. I'll try. I'll, I'll deal with it. Okay, in this goal, apparently you have to warn the skaters before Officer Tom gets there. That basically means skate towards the arrows, and that's it. The occasional grind works out. For speed, of course, now we gotta beat him to the Coliseum. Yeah, these early goals, there's not much to them, are they? Let's go over here. Where the hell is Officer Tom? It's kind of slow. But there's a timer. Apparently I have 15 seconds to get to him. Where is the Coliseum? Is it down here? I... One clock jock. Last one in front of the parking garage. Oh man, there's Officer Tom, you crazy guy. We're, we've already went that way. We're just gonna try to get to the parking garage in time. I have 10 seconds. That's actually cutting it pretty close. Or not, since he's just right there. Hey, skaters. Officer Tom is coming at ya. You better watch it. More stats will be done off screen. Saving will be done off screen in the interest of time. Who's up here? I think it's the professor. So, professor, what do you have to say? The professor hates me. He just knocked me off the entire building. I want to talk to him, though. I think his goal is kind of interesting. Let's talk to him. Goodness gracious! My car! They're stealing my baby! Try to stop them! Hold up while behind the professor's car to grab the bumper and skitch it. Skitching is also a new move. Introduced in Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 3 for the Game Boy Advance, which came out before this game. It had skitching in it as well. There's something you might have known that you might not have known anyway. The skitching is really easy. It gives you a balance bar, but... It's, it's, you're really not letting go of it. It's very, very lenient. You could probably sketch all day if you wanted to. Now let's talk, see what um, uh, Mr. Jefferson yep. wants to talk about again. Then let's start out with some spine transfers over the wall. Spine transfers over the wall. This is basically a tutorial telling you how to do a spine transfer. It's very easy. You might be thinking to yourself, oh, I gotta do a kickflip now. You might be thinking to yourself, well, spine transfers aren't hard. No, they're not. But this game does get a lot harder, so... Let's see what we can do here. Another stat point. No stat points for now. No saving now. More goals, goals, goals. This game is all about goals. I think it has 190 goals in it. That's a lot of goals. I think that's... That might be more goals than the first three games combined. Um, let's not talk to him now, because he's a pro skater. He probably wants something interesting. Let's talk to all the normal people first. Who are you? Local inline skater. Hey, man. There's no way you're faster than me. Okay, then. Let's 
see if you can beat my best time at the ultimate inline route. Well, I'm not an inline skater, but let's... Okay. Tony Hawk 4 also began the tradition of adding goals that have nothing to do with skating. This is one of them. So yeah, this is basically, I guess, just a racing goal. Hit all the checkpoints in order to, win, to beat the goal and they try to sneak, they try to fool you by putting the last one in there. New record set, $250. That's, that's a lot, actually. No, I don't want to save now. Interest of time, remember? So anyway, it's time to find more goals. What else? That's all this game is, goals. Um, and the storyline, I guess, is to complete goals. Let's talk to Bob Burnquist, because he's cool. Check this out. The local shop is sponsoring a competition. It's all about getting a big combo. You'll get 10 seconds to start one. Best two out of three runs count. You want to give it a roll? Sure, these are the new competitions. They, they're they inside the levels now, and I don't know... I don't know how many points I need. Whoa, only 10 seconds. At least let me do something. Like an American tribute. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just go a bunch of times around. It's probably all we need to do. Oh crap, I fell. I got greedy with my spins. Average 85. See if we can beat the first two skaters ahead of us and get first place. It shouldn't be too hard. As long as I actually nail my moves. That should be that should be good. 162,000, yep. The judges, they love me. Now let's do that one more time. Can we do it? Can we do it? Yes, because it's not hard at all. That should be enough. Yeah, that's definitely more than enough. And Larry, coming out of nowhere, took the high score competition and another $250. We're going to keep playing this level because we're not done with it yet. Let's find more goals, more goals, more goals. It's all about goals. I still don't want to talk to you. Because I don't know what goal you're going to give me. Let's talk to Ollie the Bum. Hey, skater person. My combo letters got away from me. Do me a favor and collect the letters, letters all, all in one, one combo. I get it. This is a new type of goal. The combo goal. Basically, it's like the skate letter goal. Why can't I do this? It's like the skate goal. Why can't I do this? It's like the skate goal, except you have to get all letters in one combo. It's kind of... Well, it gets harder. That's not... Oh, that's a dollar sign. I've already got the combo. Kid. Nice one. Kid. And Ollie the Bum has problems if you haven't figured that out yet. Anyway, I have about two minutes left. Let's check what goals I have to do. These some of them are locked. Some of them are have question marks on them. But at least they tell you where the goals are. I don't want to start a goal and not have time to finish it. So I guess I might as well change my stats in this last minute and a half and we'll call it an episode. So, um, how do I do this? Options. Edit stats. Okay, I got five stat points. That's pretty good, actually. I don't know what to... I never know what to boost up. I always boost up switch and speed. And I always turn lip balance all the way down. So anyway, let's let's boost rail and manual, get them to the default stats. Three more, um don't know what to boost up. You get stats pretty fast in this. So let's just boost that up three. We'll do it nice and evenly. And I'll save the game off screen and we'll call that the first episode of Let's Play Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. It, this playthrough, I have no idea how long it's going to play. It might actually take a while. We'll find out. I'll see you next time.